Hello again, I'm Shirley Nalakas. I'm David Navarro. We want to get right back to that breaking news that we've been following. Two people rescued after a helicopter forced to make an emergency landing in the water off of Long Island. Newscopter 7 was over the sea. You can see the chopper on the water. Long Island reporter Kristen Thorne live at the Coast Guard station at Fire Island with more. Kristen. Charlene and Dave, as we speak, the pilot and passenger are inside the Coast Guard station right here speaking with the FAA about what happened. This is new video just in. It shows the pilot and the passenger leaving the Suffolk County police boat and heading into the Coast Guard station. The helicopter is registered to Awesome Flight LLC based out of White Plains. We spoke with them and they told us everyone, as you can see from this video, is okay. The FAA says the helicopter crashed into the waters off Gilgo Beach about 10 30 this morning. It had departed earlier from Westchester County Airport. The pilot and passenger thankfully were wearing their life jackets. The FAA says the pilot sent out a mayday call before crashing into the water and a commercial flight heading into JFK heard that mayday call and alerted the FAA. So rescue crews were able to respond very quickly, including two lifeguards who went out on kayak to get the victims, retrieve them from the water and help them until police arrived. Both people were safely recovered by two ocean rescue kayaks from the lifeguards on uh, Gilgo Beach and from there they were transferred to the Suffolk County Marine Bureau and then brought back here to the station. And we are expecting the pilot to issue a statement as soon as he finishes up with the FAA here. As soon as we get that we will bring it to you. For now we're live in Bayshore. I'm Kristen Thorne, Channel 7 Eyewitness News.